Well, this week, uh, we're going to bring you back to discuss our three-point retractor hidden system. And these are the parts that we're going to show you that we welded into the floor here from the other side so we can show you the little pieces. This little wedge section goes right up against the inside rocker straight down in the floor the way Louie's holding it right there. And it goes in and it uh, finishes off the box and it gets welded to the box. And it, it adds so that you can attach it to the inside rocker because there's a space in there. The box itself, it has a little washer on each side and the inside you can see down in there and that's what the belt uh, the retractor system bolts to. This ring gets put on an angle and when it gets welded in you just clear and cut off the top of the box to match. This is our heavy duty piece uh, that the bolts actually bolt to underneath. You can't see it when the piece is together but this goes underneath and it actually attaches to the um, floor, the back side, underside of the floor and then uh, you stick the box down in there because you have to be able to take the box out to be able to service it and it'll slip in and out so you can get the retractor out of it so you can get to both, the, to both bolts. Uh, and of course it'll be all covered by carpet and you won't see it. But you can see the countersink bolts in that too. We don't have countersink bolts in the one we have bolts in the floor now but that'll be this so it keeps it level with the carpet. And a little trim ring will go on to look good. We'll show you here what's going on. Um, Louie installed the hidden seat belt retractor in the floor and uh, got his pocket put in and it's all braced in, welded in and bolted in so you can unbolt it to take it out if you ever need to service it and then the belt pulls up and this is going to have a, an astution on here once the carpet goes down this will have a little bracket kind of like my two fingers and we'll have it black chromed and it'll be a nice little detail piece finished off that will show you how the uh, unit uh, comes together we come on the other side and this is the inside uh, pocket for the, the uh, retractor where the actual uh, buckle will be and you can see this is the other side without without the you know the seat in the way. You can see that's exact duplicate on the other side, and we'll show you what it looks like once in. This is the back view. Of course, we're going to put a plate in the back of the seat. You won't even see this, but this allows to go up a little bit depending on if you move the seat back or forward. It does have a little bit of rotation on it, and then the buckle comes right out and it goes around the occupant, and that'll all be finished off too. So, there you go. We'll take a look at it in action. Louie in here getting ready to demonstrate the uh, three-point retraction system. Uh, show you how it hooks up. Pulls it across the lap. Pulls out the one on the floor. Clicks it in. Reaches back with a hidden one on the roof. Clicks it in. And you can see where it fits on his shoulder real nice and a proper place uh, right on the collarbone so that it doesn't affect his neck and hurt his shoulder. And that's the proper point. And then we just releases it. When the occupant wants to come out, and goes right back in place.